raid sirens blare across Kharkiv as dancers make their way to rehearsal. When city first came under siege, alarms would send them running to the nearest underground shelter, where they would await ardment. Now, more than 500 days later, the dancers have learned to ignore the sirens. Whaler became part of the soundtrack as he prepared for showtime in Ukraine's easternmost major city, just 15 miles from the Russian border. In afternoon, nine women gathered around the dance pole at flash dances. Only women-owned exotic dance club in Kharkiv. Prostitution is illegal in Ukraine, placing strip clubs in a legal gray area. But law was rarely enforced even before the war. Country had one of Eastern Europe's most thriving sex tourism scenes, with an estimated 80,000 sex workers in 2016. Today, while Kharkiv police are busy defending the city from Russian saboteurs and helping thwart missile attacks, Ukrainians appear to accept that a vice modem may have been tolerated, even embraced amid war grinding austerity. Our goal is to be a transition from what happened, says Valeria Zavodskaya, the club's 24-year-old co-owner. Under club's dim red lighting, Valeria leads the dancers through rehearsal as Cristina Aguilera's express blasts over PA love. Sex ladies. No regrets. One. Two. Move back. Valeria orders. Take two steps and then bam. With arms stretched behind her head, she demonstrates move, lifting herself upside down onto pole, splitting legs, spinning in air and landing on beat. A dancer looks stupid. She tries the move, but she nearly flies into the air before stumbling. I won't do that, she says. Yes you will, says Valeria, showing again, for the next two hours with indefatigable drill sergeant precision. Her dancers work through every pop and pirouette of the routine as Aguilera's power ballad plays on. A seemingly endless loop all the ladies are confident. Show off men can throw it if you want can he feel it. Burlesque Valeria shouts last line as she navigates the dances throughout song. Changing burlesque to flash dance. Valeria's mother former professional Soviet dancer, gave the club a night out when it opened decade ago. Express, a song from the movie Burlesque in which she plays the club owner and mother figure, winks at mother-daughter ownership. Signs of war are everywhere. Windows on three floors above the club were shattered after an explosion in central Kharkiv last year shattered every window on the block. Since Flash Dances is in basement, which doubles as an air raid shelter, staff and tenants who live above the club can wait out rocket strikes in red leather booths. Surrounding Dance Pole The club lost three employees in the war. Two of them are married couple who met there. More than a million residents have fled Kharkiv. And the few who remain can afford to spend an evening at Flash Dances where a drink costs three times as much as before the war. There are never more than 20 guests. Some nights no on.